Hey Cedar Park, this is Dr. John again. So we've been seeing, especially as people have been getting back to work and doing things, we've been seeing a lot of people coming in, especially into our office with wrist pain, carpal tunnel type symptoms. And so I just want to explain a couple things of what's going on there, but also different things you can do to help out. And so with carpal tunnel symptoms, that's that pain coming into that wrist. So there's a few things that people don't understand. We all think it's just in the wrist, but there's actually a few places from the elbow, shoulder, and neck that, that can also entrap that nerve, given these symptoms. But once it entraps the nerve, then all of a sudden I always put it down the river from that nerve is where we're going to have the symptoms. So different things that you can do is one, watch your ergonomics at your desk right there to bring your body upright because it's when we start to crouch over that we have that but also move that wrist. So you want to stretch that wrist out a lot to help it to get back to doing what you need to. And then third, go right into this muscle right by the elbow and start to massage right in there, which is going to help to free up a lot of the symptoms going to that wrist. Also, after you get done with this, if you're still having those symptoms, make sure to give us a call and we'll be glad to help you out to get away from that carpal tunnel to make it so we don't have to head towards those surgeries or anything like that that can impede us for the rest of our life.